guys welcome back to the channel my name is princess banigo and i am back with a bunch of cheese for you guys so all my returnees you're welcome and if any thank you so much so let's start with nelo keke and our girl uche and see eh, i know the matter no concern me but i am pissed i am pissed okay this is why i said so so nelo keke put out a vlog and in the vlog in between we saw uche you know and then you know we had nelo asking uche that um about video content or whatever but at the end of the day which was telling Nelo, oh auntie i thought you're going to edit it for me and then Nelo had this to say she has like not like what she has it's not two videos or three videos oh, on my laptop now the ones that i've been on my laptop she hasn't said it the channel will be closed <laughs> it will happen you see that channel it will be closed it's it's very soon do you want for me to edit it what? jesus christ I rest my case. She was with me. I was sourcing my own editing. My assistant now edits for me. And I can't be editing your own. Gone are the days. Gone are the days. What I normally do for Uche is before, before, before you guys, for like maybe one year straight, I edited all her videos completely, right? Then I was like, I cannot do this job forever. So I let her edit it so that she'll be practicing because, I mean, you're not going to have Nelo forever to edit your videos. So I let her edit it, then I will now um, go through it. And sometimes, <sighs> Jesus, a lot of rubbish, a lot of rubbish. I just still have to mend. But yeah, that's, that's the best I can offer you right now. If you like, don't go edit and put out videos. Anyways. So basically, you guys had Nelo there. You know saying like so uche you are waiting for me to come edit even when i have an assistant that is for me you you're waiting for me to come and edit video for you like uche is one of the most unserious youtuber that i have ever met and she doesn't understand the luck she has having someone like nelo on her side there are people who are looking forward to watching her content even if her content is not like a hundred percent people will consume the content and still enjoy it because they've grown to like her person and i don't understand why uche uh, I wanted to say Uche always the Uche Utom. I don't understand why Uche Utom is deciding not to be serious with her YouTube career. It vexes me on her behalf. Like I'm annoyed on her behalf because Uche, please, if you don't need your channel, come and give me that vlog channel. Let me just start creating content on it because you already have audience. Eh, at least maybe they'll just be surprised. And when did I subscribe to this person? But at least I'll still give you because I'm not understanding why she's not, you know, taking advantage and making money. Maybe the money that you know Nelo is paying her, she's contented with it. But this is your social media career. In as much as you're trying to study or whatever, even if it's once in two weeks, make sure you put out content. Try and create something. But I think I'm not going to, you know, get worked up because of Uche. Okay, she she doesn't know what you have. You don't know what you have until it's gone. Let me leave it at that. Let's jump into editorial. Mm, my people, wahala. This editorial, at the Golden Hotel, you they bring wahala. Hey, everybody want go. But before we even enter into the going, editorial dropped a video where she showed Lizzie in the video where Lizzie was, you know, with her carrying the child. And, you know, I saw a comment there that just touched my heart somehow. And the person was like, um, oh, how she wished Lizzie was going to come back. And, you know, I don't know. I don't know why, you know, all the things that happened then, why Editora chose to take Lizzie, according to her, it was because of the comments she was getting about Lizzie. That was why she took her back, you know, to her mother. I don't know if that is truly the reason. And then, yes, people reacted to, you know, people reacted to the things that, you know, they saw that was happening to Lizzie through Editorial's channel, especially with the fact that the birthday, that birthday that happened, you know, they said it was just five meat and whatever, you know. I don't think, I don't think I reacted to that content then. I can't remember. But whatever the case may be, Editorial has already taken Lizzie back to her family. We don't know if Lizzie is going to come back, but Eddie said Lizzie is going to come back. And it would be really nice for that child, you know, if Lizzie comes back, because we know that Editorial is not broke, right? And she can afford to take care of Lizzie if she wants to so it'll be good if lizzie comes back but i mean it's a family business they know what they're doing if she's ever going to come back we don't know but when i saw lizzie in that video you know it just made me remember how lizzie used to create content for ed she, how she when she came she wasn't so you know fluent with english and then she became very good she'll pick up the camera prank her auntie and whatnot i feel like okay some of the viewers sometimes they could calm down we're going to calm down. Reactors are always going to react, okay? And I don't think two reactors' content or three is going to make a creator 
just you know change their mind but the commenters when the comment is so much everybody is bombarding you bra 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 it might just make you feel like you know whatever but i don't know if that is the reason why edit actually took lizzie back but let's just move on into the next gist okay i never knew that uk family could sing this much like i didn't know uk had such angelic voice until this at the golden hotel matter came out <laughs> guys uk has been serenading us with music literally and then she had this music to sing in the video she dropped today we, need, we are better together one love one father one kingdom and one family one shepherd no division we are better together we are all we need we are better together one love so you guys had uk singing there hmm. the music no be small though. she was really singing and thanking god so according to her she had a couple of things to say about you know editorial and her going to editorial hotel lunch she was telling us that she's definitely going to be there and if you don't like it make you go use your head in aqua basically that she's going to be there that sisters fight in short make it not be like that they talk too much let's listen to her is there any family that has not had problem they have so if we had made mistakes we are going to be correcting our mistakes is left for us to correct our mistakes and all i need for you guys is just come and celebrate with us yes because mama of boys is the happiest person I think it's real well that's left for you because i know that before anything a plant has already been down for years and me i am very very happy for any good because you're always there for me i love you people because most times when i look at comments hundred over five ah that hundred sometimes 200 over five so i pick the 200 which are the good ones and i know you guys which as well thank you for watching come on and celebrate with us i am still going to be singing the celebration to you the d day yes it's gonna happen live so guys mama is gonna jack her bag i'm gonna jack my box Jack my balls and my bag set off I go. That's so. <laughs> so according to you know UK, you guys heard that there she was talking and saying that family fight and they settle and you know even though she gets like eight and likes the likes are more than the eight and that is what she's banking and running with. I think it's a good one for you to run with the positivity and dump the negative. But also, I wanted to, uh, you know, talk to the viewers, okay? An issue happened, right, between Edith and UK. Now, I really don't know if UK is going to go because she was all dressed, you know, carrying a bag. I don't know. And, and I'm sure that was just, um, you know, a video or something. But I don't know if she's going to be attending, which is possible that she's going to be attending. But if you see it, UK and Edith that they actually finally made up. You guys should not go and add fire and bridge to and call UK devil and Edith devil or Edith is not wise for forgiving her sister. You guys should allow them. If it's your own blood, your own siblings or your own cousin that had the fight, okay, they both insulted each other. Both of them insulted each other. UK insulted, it is insulted, right? So I don't think this is the time for you guys to even now start saying it is her sense. So UK, well, UK, why were you gonna beg that? No, I don't think this is the time. You guys should just allow them forgive each other and heal from it. Okay, you know, me say drama, I will come straight tomorrow and we will go react. But I mean, while they are trying to make peace, let them make peace. I mean, there's nothing in this life after all. Okay, so me, I, I support with them. I agree with them. If they can make peace, I think it's a good one for them to make peace and move past this whole drama and learn from their mistakes according to uk you learn from your mistake so hopefully they've learned from the mistake when you want to address issue with your sister as much as possible you know try and keep it in the private part and even if you're going to come outside you know be very wise about it even if you have to come outside and before you come outside know that is the last result you know or if you're very wise you know how you go about it you don't need to come direct you can go like this about it yeah
yeah anyway guys thank you so much for watching this video if you watched up to this point i appreciate you guys please subscribe to this channel give the video a big thumbs up and i will see you guys in another video bye for now